y'all so my electricity just went out journey with me make sure you subscribe but anyways besides that um thank you for watching thank you for tuning in um i hope you guys enjoy it i'm getting to a place where i'm trying to you know do more things um i've always been a homebody but it's like lately i want to get out you know what i'm saying i want to go outside i want to you know be outside and chill and play and blah 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 so anyways today is a saturday what is the date i think it's august 26th yeah it's august 26th saturday um i worked a little bit earlier um and also i just finished doing my makeup we are supposed to be going out to um i'm not 100 sure i know we are going to this restaurant called top pot which is like a hot pot korean barbecue style restaurant i went one time but i got there late and everybody wanted to leave so i couldn't really enjoy myself like that but the things that i did eat was so good anyway we're going back today um we went a few months ago um and my my nieces went and my my niece jamel she just turned seven and she requested to go back there for her birthday so that's what we're doing today and like i said i just finished doing my makeup for that what time is it? i think it's it's a little after 2 p.m so i just did my makeup i think we're supposed to be going around five ish six ish i'm not sure i'm about to go finish doing my hair i'm just doing like a little quick week girl ain't nothing on going on under this i don't know why i did my makeup before that i just you know shit just yet um but that is the plans for today i will see y'all in a minute now before i continue doing my hair i want to show y'all this order that i got from these little things i was going to do like a haul video but i didn't feel like i had enough stuff so i just do it here let's see what we got all the good things that i ordered I got some baby food, so I'm supposed to be going. Well, I'm going on a cruise the end of next month. So I just got a few things for for that. And just a few things. I haven't got everything. I haven't gotten everything yet. So. I got this bathing suit bottom. So this is, and they had to refund me for the top because they ran out of the top. So I don't know how the hell that's gonna work. But these are the bottoms. Ooh, ooh it's so cute. This is the front of the back. The top was like long sleeve. I'm gonna show y'all like a little picture of how the top looks. But it was so cute. I'm gonna have to, I don't know, either reorder when they back in stock or get a different top or something. I don't know. This is a different bathing suit. This is like a black. I don't know if I bought this too big, child. And it got like the gold hardware on there. These might be too big. I don't know. And then here's the top that goes with it. 
and it's just like a tube top type thing. Um, I don't know if this looks like or not. It's just like a tube top, and it also has like the hardware as well. Like that. So, I got this this um like tote bag. It's so like it's like an oversized tote bag. I don't know if this is like vacation vibes, but for um, beach vibes because we supposed to be going to the Bahamas. But, um, I just thought it was so cute. So, this is how it looks. Um, oh my gosh, it's so cute. It has like, they're like a little tie in the front. Can you see that? And it's just like, it has gold hardware with some buttons and a zipper. Inside, let's see. There are pockets. Oh my gosh, and like a little zipper thing. This is so freaking cute. I'm so glad I got this. I'm so glad I got this. You know, you know, with a nice little dress, whatever. Whatever not. So we got that. And then this is another baby suit, I think. Yeah. This is a one piece um bathing suit. I think we get shit too big. This shit look kinda big, nah. I don't know. I'm done got turned into a big girl now. So this is like a one piece. I'm gonna show y'all how it look on like the model. I might have to switch this out because this shit is so big. Too big. I'm gonna try them on though. I'll let y'all know. And then I got like this uh, linen outfit, which I shouldn't have got because I get makeup on every damn thing. I shouldn't have got it this color, rather. And it's just like, you know, basic white linen shirt. You know, whatever, whatever. It looked kind of yellow. Yellow it's supposed to be just like off. It's supposed to be kind of like the same color as the bag. From what I remember, or from what I saw. And then the pants. These are the pants. It's like something. I have somebody else check that for me. But yeah, these are the pants. It's like oversized. Oh, like linen outfit. And I'm out the one. I don't even remember what my shoes I got for real. Oh, oh these are so cute. I got, all these. So I got these. They just like some green, kind of like towel, kind of like towel material. They look so comfortable. Yes, they fit. I wear a size eight in girls, eight shoes. Um, all this stuff comes pretty good for you can see. I got these, which are kind of like, I think these are like the Birkenstock type dupes. And these are just some slides. I think I just bought these. I don't, I don't think I bought these for vacation per se, but I just got them because I thought it was cute. Are so comfy. Um, and then these last ones. Oh, these are just supposed to be some flat slides. 
I might send these back. I don't like how these look already. I thought it was like all one color. It's like tan on the outside and kind of like a yellowish tan on the inside. I'm going to see how much they cost. And if they over a certain price, they're going back. And I got these. These right here. I just feel like these are so cute. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like with some with like a little dress, some ankle socks, some ankle anklets, and so on and so forth. And they're so cute with like oversized stuff because they kind of look like boots. They're so cute. They're a little funky. This is not really my normal style, but I saw them and I thought it was just so cute. Okay. And then the last one are just like these basic, just like white and black um, slides with a little platform on there i think these are so cute i think them other slides gonna go back though like, i don't like them at all either they going back or they getting given away i just want to tell you how like my edges you see how like this is going right there and it's like the other side so i started i want to preface this by saying it's not this company's fault okay it's not their fault it's my fault. I started to use the Myel hair oil. My bad, my bad hair went out. But anyways, like I was saying, I started to use the Myel or Miel, however you say it, hair oil. And at first, you know, everything's going good and everything. And then one day I started seeing chunks of my hair just fall out. So I'm like, what the fuck? At first I thought it was like stress, but then I realized, um, I don't know if I'm allergic or not, but when, like if I take hair, skin, and nail peels or anything with biotin in it, even though it's supposed to like make your hair grow, my hair like falls out in chunks, like from the root, like sheds, just sheds. And at first I didn't know what the fuck was happening and I didn't even realize it was biotin in it even though i probably would have still took it because it has by if it has biotin in it because it's a topical thing it's not something that you like take internally so i had to stop taking it the only thing that works for me to make my hair that makes my like hair like really grow is msm if you don't want, don't know what msm is m like mary sam mary um it's really like a supplement for like joints to like lubricate joints and stuff like that but it helps your skin and your hair and your nails and it really makes my hair grow that's like the only thing that i've taken that makes my hair grow so i started back taking that to like you know repair what the biotin has done um but yeah so if you have a biotin sensitivity or anything like that just either like you know if you get the myel hair oil use it sparingly because i was using that shit every day maybe that was the problem i was using it every day but it says it's for daily use so um yeah so um i stopped using it i know a lot of people that it works for and like i said it was working for me at first um so it's just like a personal experience i don't think i don't think anything bad about the company by the way this hair is from hair so fab i've already worn this hair i had to take it out because my hair is itching really bad so i'm just redoing it and i'm about to um probably layer it this is like um burmese i think 30 inch yeah this is the burmese 30 inch i'm just gonna like frame my face into a little um one two or whatever but before I do that, I'm gonna have my edges eased on really quick. You see that? Gone. Gone, honey. There's even more chunks in the middle. Hey y'all, so I couldn't show y'all my outfit because 
because I had to change and I forgot my damn earrings. <laughs> Anyways, change of plans. The restaurant that we're gonna go to, um, they aren't taking they aren't taking any reservations. I mean, they aren't taking um, any seats. Or they aren't seating anybody until about eight o'clock. And right now it's like 5.45. So we all uh, chose to go to like, we are going to China Buffet right now because we're hungry. And um, we're probably gonna go to Top Pot until tomorrow or next week. <laughs> <laughs> hey. hey, so I'm back from my outing. So I want this body con type of regular dress with a it's a white um button down shirt. Fenty was the fragrance of the night and I'm about to Take a shower and wash this makeup off. battery my camera went dead so I had to switch out batteries put my um my scarf I put my scarf on around my edges and then I put my bonnet away um and then I got my nightly drink this is just a cocktail of water a little bit of like um 100% cranberry juice and stevia I drink this every night it tastes good that is good for you. I've been watching. I've been watching One Tree Hill. I don't know if y'all remember that show. Um, it's from like the early 2000s. I used to watch it. But I only watched like the older years. Like when they was like grown already. They was out of school. Out of college. All, the, all that stuff. I used to watch it then. Um, I never watched it like from the beginning. Like when it was in high school and stuff. So. Um, my, my sister is watching it and she's begging me to watch it. She says it's so good. So, every time I put it on, though, I end up scrolling or falling asleep or something. So, I'm I keep this is gonna be my third time putting it back on to watch it. After this, if I don't watch it, I'm gonna lay it down. I'm gonna put dress. Um, what else have I been watching? I was watching the summer I turned pretty, but that is over the finale came on either this last Friday. The finale came on last Friday. What else have I been watching? I haven't really been into TV. I've been watching a lot of YouTube. Last night I was just catching up on Rick and Morty. Y'all know. If you watch Rick and Morty, y'all you know that show is crazy. And because the new season is about to come out in October, so I've been watching that and what else I watch a lot of shows y'all I watch a lot of shows um I'll watch that shit and just like never like know what it's called um anyways I'm tired so I'm probably just gonna put some something on um like family guy or something and go sleep yeah, I'll watch some YouTube. Good morning, y'all. It's the next day. It's about 12 p.m. 
Um, I worked a few hours this morning. I'm just getting ready now to go to home, huh? Um, whatever. Um, today we're going to Target. My phone is ringing. Hold on. Today we're going to Target. I need to pick some stuff up. Get something for my nieces for her for her birthday. And what else do I have to do? I need to clean up my house. That's what we're doing today again. Um, and um, what else? What else am I doing? I'm not sure. We'll play it by you. I'm just like doing my skincare and doing a little bit of makeup before I leave the house. Um, I'm not going to fix my hair. I'm just going to put a hat on because I ain't got time. That's what I have planned today and I got to prepare myself for tomorrow or for the week. For my work week. Yeah, come on and so forth. Today's foundation will be Makeup by Mario. I'm just like putting some off I have like a little dark marks. And my nails still ain't done. Like, um, I haven't got my nails done because it's been the beginning of school year and so my sister has to do, my sister does my nails and she has a lot of, well she had a lot of people's nails to do and then uh so this week i just never got around to going so this week um it was on me because i never i just never got around to going to get my nails done um i honestly don't even know when i'm gonna get them done because i know it's not gonna be the day and then she's been sick as well so it's not that i didn't want to be around her while she was sick i just wanted her to you know recover or whatever so yeah that's what's happening. Yeah. I have to put this on my hands because I cannot find. I just love the fact that this Makeup by Mario foundation doesn't really have a fragrance. That it's just like so refreshing because. And it doesn't smell like how makeup usually smells. <laughs> it kind of smells like unseasoned <laughs> oatmeal kind of this is my first time doing my foundation with my fingers and i gotta say oh with my hands and i gotta say i really like it hold on because i be seeing the girls do their makeup with they or put their foundation on with their hands and i be like i can't it's just i don't know it's not that i can't it's just um getting makeup on your hands and then you know i don't know but it's actually not bad hold on pretty powder and banana i've been using like the huda beauty beauty powder but i just feel like it's just so heavy not heavy duty well yes heavy duty i don't think it's like for like every day you know it's a lighter powder powder the fenty i'm just gonna use the milk setting spray Better waste your pain and time Pacing around, hate this cool Like I'm waiting for you To come lie to me Your love language Show me, yeah Did you take a picture? <laughs> They got a grand rising barbie with a jewel. I want this one. It's gonna be okay. me. It's so cool. Like a little neck kit. So a pumpkin. What is this? How oh, you get to paint the ghost? How much is this? Ten dollars. Look at this candle. Cashmere rose. Which It smells so good. Whitney! No, it got a baba. Whitney, yeah. Whitney, yeah, it got a baba. And Johnny got the pumpkin. Yep, and I got the whiskey. Can you take a picture of those? That? Yeah, I wanted And that? You can take a picture of both? Yeah. Hey, y'all. It's. Um, I'm not sure the last time I saw y'all, but 
today is august 29th it's 5 16 and uh, i just got off of work i'm working all well, day working hard if y'all don't know um if y'all don't know there is a hurricane about to hit jacksonville florida if y'all didn't know i live in jacksonville florida um it's supposed to be hitting tomorrow i don't really watch the news my sister and my mom watch the news and they you know tell me everything um i was supposed to go to the movies two days my movie night or as my setup movie night i'm supposed to go to the movies tonight but i don't know since the hurricane and all that stuff even though it's supposed to be coming tomorrow um i don't know so my mama had got me some waters um publix and i did me a doordash order for some supplies from when Dixie, I tried to do it from Publix. They ain't had the stuff I needed, and I tried to do a Walmart pickup. They did not have the stuff I needed either, or they um they didn't have pickup times until Thursday. Today is Tuesday. The hurricane is supposed to be hitting tomorrow, um, and they didn't have any slots open until Thursday. Um, so I had to do what I had to do. I was in here DoorDash pick up and I just got a few things um nothing too major and also I just want to tell y'all you know I showed y'all them bathing suits um that I bought the other day from pretty little thing and I said one of them was too big <laughs> not too big I tried it on you girl I tried it on your girl been your girl been eating good <laughs> but yeah so that one piece bathing suit that y'all seen or that y'all saw, um, it does fit. So I'm happy about that. I don't have to send it back or nothing like that. Um, and the other bathing suit also fits. So everything's good, everything's fragile. I didn't try on the linen outfit yet. Um, I tried on all the shoes, everything, everything's good. Everything's a go. Um, I still need to try on that linen um also today i got a amazon um package and i just want to show y'all what i got so i got this and this is like this is like a um a car mount for my camera because i want another car mount and it's for like my phone and it, it works for my phone but it does not there's no way I could hook my camera up to it. I thought it was gonna have like a little part, like this part right here that I can like screw on and screw off, but it doesn't have that. So I had to buy this. The other the other thing that's in my car is on my windshield, which it been so hot in Jacksonville that the plastic part is kind of melting. It's a whole thing. But um, this one I'm gonna put on the dash put this on the dash before so i'm excited about this i also got i just got a new um memory card and it came with a uh yeah i got this memory card and it came with like this i guess memory card cleaner i didn't know memory cards needed to be clean but whatever um but the thing i'm most excited about is this This is the, I don't know if y'all can see this. This is the Simply Modern 40 ounce Trek Tumbler with straw and handle. I got this off of, again, Amazon. Um, I saw somebody on TikTok with this. And I was like, oh, I want that because I am, I am obsessed with like monotone stuff. I don't want it or looking into getting me like a Stanley cup. And I was gonna get one from like Target or whatever, but I saw this girl, that thing, I saw this girl on TikTok with this one. I forgot her name, I follow her. I forgot her name. And then I just randomly saw it on YouTube one day. I mean, not YouTube, I randomly saw it on, um, Got it. I'm opening it for something. 
And I was, when I saw her with it, I was obsessed with it because like I said, I'm a monotone girl. And it's, oh my God, look at the color. It's so pretty. And that's the top. I'm sorry about the lighting. Like, that's the top, how it looks. And also, it comes with two straws that are the same color. Like, how can you not be obsessed with this? Like, this is so. I think I want to get these in all of the, like, the neutral tone colors. They also have a black one, and I was trying to decide between which one I wanted. I got this. I ended up getting this one because I feel like it matches a lot of things. It matches my couch, it matches everything. It's a vibe. <laughs> And then, um, I guess they give you instructions or whatever. But, yeah, this is the top. And you just screw this on and off. I, I got this for, like, my water and stuff in the morning. I drink water with chlorophyll every morning. So, I said I was just going to, I don't know, make, probably make my ice water in this and keep it in this. And... You know, while I'm working, sipping, sipping, sip, 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 sip. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm so excited about this. Like, y'all don't even know. It's so pretty. I'm put the straw in. And this one, this this straw area is like kind of silicone-y. Yes, it's like made out of silicone. The straw is made from plastic. And this, of course, is made out of metal. Yeah. And it's metal on the inside. Let me show y'all the inside. See, that's how the inside looks. And it's big enough for me to clean out. Like, I hate these stains when it's, like, hard to clean. <sighs> I'm so excited about this. And I think this top, the whole top is made out of plastic. And then this part is, like, made out of silicone. Let's see. And then I said I was gonna get like some of those straw covers that you could like put on and then cover it up with. But I haven't found any, like I just said, I'm a monotone. I always call myself a monotone whore because I love monotone anything. But a, a monochrome, or however you wanna say it. I haven't found any like straw covers that is like this color, so I haven't bought any yet. They don't have them on Amazon. I searched for a long time. I was trying to buy them all at the same time and um I couldn't find it so yes that is it and um I might still go to the movies I'm not sure if not I'll just be chilling however I want to talk about how I don't like going to the movies like I like going to movies yes but I don't like to go to the movies on opening night like ever since um, like on the opening night of the movies when they first come out, like the first weekend, all of that shit. Oh, when it's like being like overly hyped, or you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't like going to the movies then because of that time when that Batman movie came out and that man shot up the um, the movie theater. Ever since then, I don't like going like opening weekend or maybe. If it's a bigger movie, like every, like when it's like being like super hyped, I don't like to go because people are crazy. And if you, you know, if you have been living under a rock, you already know, like this past week, today is the 29th, August 29th, this past week, there was a mass shooting in Jacksonville, Florida. You know what I'm saying? So it's just like, nowhere especially in america it ain't safe nowhere it's safe i don't even like going to supermarket no more i always do the walmart pickups target like i, I still go in target sometimes but um 
I like I don't go inside Walmart. There was a, the last time I went inside Walmart was probably twenty. Nah, I'm lying. But like I go very few and far between. I'd rather do a Walmart pickup instead of walking through stuff because stuff like that. That's why I haven't gone to see Barbie yet. That's what I was planning on going to see tonight. But I might um, either hold it till Thursday or next Tuesday. We'll figure it out. August 30th, early in the morning. Um, I'm here watching. I'm here watching CNN, and apparently, the um, Hurricane Adalia. Is that how you say it? Hurricane Adalia is about to hit Florida at about 8 a.m. And they're talking about it's a once in a lifetime storm, all this stuff. <sighs> Uh, land, this could end up being an extremely Knock on wood, but I feel like they be trying to scare us on the news. Am I I feel like they be trying to scare us. Um, I live in Jacksonville, so I don't think we're gonna get hit that hard, but we shall see. Um, we shall see. I still have to um work today, so. And I work from home, so um, I'll be at the house. Hopefully, my electricity does not go out. Um, but we shall see. So, I have all the things that I said that I needed. I told y'all yesterday that I got some supplies. I really just got some waters and some like snacks. That's all I got. And um, <clears throat> for the storm. Just in case, like, you know, like my um, electricity goes out and stuff. I'm about to go wash my face and brush my teeth for the morning and get ready for um, the day. I'm probably going to be in the house all day since it's supposed to be storming. And by the way, I did not do, I did not go to the movies last night. I decided to stay in the house. I was going to film a content video, but by the time I was able to, it was kind of late. So I decided not to do that. I'm probably going to, hopefully, if my, um, if my electricity does not go out, I can, um, record something tonight. I can record that same video tonight, so. I might have just text me. Oh. I just hope everybody being safe during this hurricane because some people, I think they have like evacuations along the coast, the Gulf Coast, especially like Tallahassee area. That look like it's gonna get hit hard. They say it's gonna be a category four by the time it hits, which is supposed to hit, like I said, at 8 a.m. So like I said, I hope y'all being safe out there. This is probably going to be posted after the storm. So see y'all on the other side. Hopefully. When I check the weather on my phone, it's saying that in Jacksonville area, we're to watch tropical storm warning and hurricane local statement. We have significant threat to life or property and everything is affected from 5 a.m. today to 2 p.m. What I don't like about this is that it's still hot as hell outside. It's still regular temperature outside. She in the winds and cooling it down. That's not funny. But, um, whatever. What is the wind? Miles per hour. My area, the area that I live in right now, um, they're very good with electricity. I usually don't get any outages. Not. Sometimes I do lately, I have been, even with a regular like storm, so um, we shall see what happens. I 
I have bought these two separately. These are two like Korean brands. This is um, Joseon, what is it called? And of course we all know about the Eason, Snail Eason by Cosrx. And somebody said to do these together. On TikTok. They were like, these together? Y'all yeah, know that sound. I know that TikTok sound. And I'm like, I'm already doing that. Oh gosh. So I just use this in the daytime. This is like the glow serum with pro propolis and niacinamide. You can see that. I just put this on first after I put on my body and see. And then the Cost RX. I usually use like five pumps. As you can see, it's mm. not. This is the also the um, snail mucin, but this is the all-in-one cream um, by Cosrx. This this is the best thing I put on my face. Like, I love this stuff. It's like, look at it, first of all. Can y'all see that? It's just so, oh my God, I fucking love it. But when you put it on your face, it just kind of like melts in. It's just a little bit like, of course it's like creamier than the, um, so now I'm using it and a little bit more slimy <laughs> is that the word but it just feels so good when you like really get it into the skin baby this is gonna be listen i'm gonna be using this for me i already know i am i thought i was obsessed with this i'm still obsessed with this but this one this try it girl try it girl Plan, baby. It ain't sponsored, it ain't nothing. You try it. And then I use these, and I basically just like in the morning time, I just I put these on. I don't do this every morning, but I put these on. Y'all have seen me before. These are the good molecules, caffeine, energizing, hydrogel, eye patches. And I just put them on until they get dry on my eyes. So I'll leave the bitches on all day. Well, for hours for a few hours or whatever i don't know if that's good or not but that's what i be doing and i never really know how to put these on correctly so i'm gonna go on this way today and you see how you can like barely even see them on it just look like i got shiny in the way and i keep all of this stuff in my mini fridge which is on a little table behind me just to have everything cool. So these are like cold right now. That cream, everything's cold. And I just use, and I just keep these on. See, I did these backwards. I don't like doing them like this, like these ones, because the like the eye scoop is kind of short. So I like to put this part in the inner corner, but I'm not gonna switch it because whatever. hours later i'm gonna um refill my water bottle and then i'm gonna continue working it's been it's just really windy it's because it's been raining it's been raining a little bit it's not that much rain it's really windy outside my windows are shaking i can hear the bitches shaking so also um, and ignore all of that stuff y'all seen back. Also, um, my apartments were kind enough to send me some instructions on how to be safe. 
And also, I got a Savora package. It smells good. I don't remember if I ordered. Oh, you know what? You know what? I did order, um, because I was about to say, I don't remember if I ordered some perfume, because I'm like, it smells good. But this was delivered by UPS, and the guy who delivers my UPS smells good. When I say smell good, he be having my whole hallway smelling amazing. This kind of smells. Oh my god. It kind of smells like Baccarat Rouge, which is not a. Don't kill me, y'all, but it's not one of my favorite fragrances. It smells good, it don't smell bad, but it's just like something in the back of it that just don't sit right with me, if that makes sense. I don't know if that's the stuff, because I, what I ordered was the, um, so, uh, one of the things I ordered was um, the Sol de Janeiro, um, like travel pack, so I could put it, so I could um, take that with me when I go on that cruise. Um, I hope that's not the smell of it. I mean, it's not bad. Like, I'll use it if I need to. But And I just blind bought it. Um, I know how the, um, the original one smells. Like, the Bum Bum Cream one smells. Which I really like that one. But it's kind of strong for me. It smells good, but it's strong. It's, it's a little bit too strong for me. I got, it smells... This Sol de Janeiro set. Um, I forgot what set this is. Beige Flora. What is it? But the um, if you can see the spray bottle part, the all the whole entire spray is is empty. It's spilled. Like what the fuck? The whole entire spray. I'm sending this shit back. It smells good. It smells good. It smells real good. I'm gonna have to send it back though, because I got it fucked up or get my money back. But it smells good and this and you get the body, you know, you get the body wash and the the little cream thing, but I'm gonna have to send it back. Um I also got the Tom for it, Sol Blanc Shimmering Body Oil. And this is just a mini one. Um, first of all, the packaging is immaculate. Of course, it's glass with the top. And let me pull up a little spray here. got the the refined brow sculpt and this was also I guess viral I got it in the clear color oh here it is the brush and the, the glue so I got that and also I got some 
some samples, I guess. The sample is um, the Glossier Milky Jelly Cleanser. I don't know if y'all can see that, child. It's just like a little cleanser. I'm probably just going to um, save this for some vacation. And I got this uh, fresh tea elixir. Serum, I guess, and I also got the Skylar Clean Beauty Peach Feels. Now, I've been hearing about this, and I uh, just wanted to kind of smell it. Let's smell it now. but not like musky peachy if that makes sense it's like very light and bright mm. kind of smells citrusy as well this shit smells so good wow it says it has notes of white peach osmanthus osmanthus and sandalwood mm. So that is it for my little Sephora haul. Um, I'm definitely taking this or getting back to this. So now, y'all. So my electricity just went out. It's not even that dark outside, but it was very freaking windy, and my electricity went out. So, but I want to tell y'all that I ended up calling Sephora and they are gonna send me another um set this set like because um because it spilled out in the box and all of that stuff it's just like the whole my whole living room smells like it and it kind of smells like um the Ariana Grande cloud which everybody says smells like the baccarat so yeah so i'm supposed to be getting that the young lady was very nice she um just resent me another set with some more samples and i was like i really appreciated that but now i'm just here waiting for my lights to come back on but i'm chilling i put my ac on low so um, I put my AC on 67 so that, uh, if this were to happen, um, my house wouldn't get too hot. You know what I'm saying? Cause even though it's like storming and stuff outside, it's still, um, hot as hell outside. And I made sure I charged my phone and my, um, uh, both my phones. So just, you know, just in case everything. But according to like the news or whatever, it's supposed to be back on soon. So we riding a storm out, and I think the worst of it's supposed to be hitting around 2 p.m. So we shall see. I'm just chilling for now, and I'm probably just gonna edit or whatever and um tomorrow i was gonna end this vlog tomorrow but tomorrow is my mom's birthday so i'm just gonna start my other vlog tomorrow um i still have to work tomorrow um we'll see what we're doing like she's very she's very simple she doesn't really she's not big on i guess celebrating like that so we're probably just gonna go and spend time or whatever so thank y'all for watching my vlog my very first vlog like comment subscribe you know what i'm saying all of the things that i showed y'all in this vlog i will have it linked below and i will see y'all in the next one bye